my name's Ashley Rice and welcome to my YouTube channel. Okay guys, today I have another Stitch Fix unboxing. For those of you who might not know what Stitch Fix is, uh, it's basically a subscription that you can decide when you want it to come. Uh, the standard is usually every single month. And in this subscription, you get five articles of clothing. Sometimes that includes shoes, bags, or accessories as well. And you get to try on the five items and then keep what you want and send back what you don't want and then you only pay for the items you want to keep. I've been doing Stitch Fix for a while now and I'm not gonna lie, I've been having kind of like a down uh, for my fixes recently. Um, I just feel like a lot of the stuff I've been getting uh, isn't either my style or it's a lot of repeat. I've already said I don't like this. Um, so I am really intrigued to see what I get today. I'm really fingers crossed that it's all exactly what I'm looking for. Though we'll see how the fit is because I think like many other people I gained a little bit of weight while being you know at home because of COVID. So um, I guess we'll see if that is an issue in this fix or not. I sadly forgot to save a screenshot of the note that I sent my stylist. Um, however, I think I, I have said a lot of the things that I've been saying recently. Um, wanting summer styles. I want them to be youthful. I want them to be trendy. Um, date night as well, even if I'm not necessarily going out on dates, whether it's just home, I still want more of those options. And I don't know if I asked for anything in particular. I might have asked for some high rise shorts in a larger size just because the last time I got shorts from them um, I had to size up even though it was a brand that I normally don't need to size up for. I don't know what it is about shorts but I have to size up in shorts for some reason. It's the weirdest thing. Um, but without further ado let's go ahead and unbox this and see what I got sent this time. Here we go. <laughs> okay there we go. That took a little bit. Okay. So every single month you're going to get this guy right here. This is what you put all of your returns or exchanges into so you can send it back to Stitch Fix. You also get this little envelope here that contains your receipt, which I'm not going to look at quite yet, but it also contains this bad boy right here. And this has your stylist note, which I always love to read, but then it also gives you some options for how you can kind of dress up the piece that you got. But I'm not going to look at those quite yet. I'm just going to read my note and see what my stylist said this time. Hi there, Ashley. I'm so glad you found some pieces you liked in your last fix. I'm sorry that skirt didn't work out. I've selected an alternative size for you this time so we can add a denim skirt to your lineup for summer. The Stormy Style by Just Black has a fun wash and I hope it's a perfect fit. Since you were hoping to try some high rise shorts in a size up or two, I'd love to hear your thoughts on this edgy button front style by Just USA. Pair them with your twist front cropped top. The Liverpool jacket will add a fun pop of color to your sleeveless top and dresses. What do you think of the vibrant red tone? Try it over the Kalila cold shoulder top with the shorts. I sized up on this top to get you a comfy, flattering fit through your bust. How does it feel? All my best, Laura. Okay, so I guess we'll see how this turns out. I guess one of the things I'm really excited about is she actually sent something to layer. Um, for those of you who have watched my videos, you probably know this. I don't like just plain sleeveless. Like I, I prefer to have something, if you're gonna send me sleeveless, that I can layer over. So I'm excited that she addressed that in my note. Um, I'm also excited that she sent me another denim skirt to try on because the other one, it just wasn't getting on no matter what. So uh, yeah, I guess we'll see how everything fits, fingers crossed. But this is what the colors look like. And the red I think is gonna be great. As you can tell, I, I like red. But let's see what these are. Okay, first piece here is actually the cold shoulder top she was talking about. I really don't think she needed to size up on this. It actually has a good amount of stretch to it. So I guess we'll see. Generally with cold shoulder tops, I do like a little bit more of that like uh, flowy style. Usually I'm not like a huge fan if it's like too flowy because I don't want it to make me look big. But for some reason with cold shoulder tops, I like that. It's the weirdest thing. I don't even know why. Um, I also like this detailing. I'm assuming that goes into the back and I'm assuming this is the front. Yes, but I think I'll like this. I've been wanting more cold shoulder pieces, so I'm excited that I finally got one. It's been forever since I last received one. Though I am glad she thought about my bust issues because I, I am busty, um, and so sometimes that is an issue. So for some reason, this 
uh, blouse is titled the Kalaya Valet Back Detail Knit Tank Top, even though it's a cold shoulder top. So I'm not sure what that is, but that's what that one's called. And it is $36. I would totally spend that for this. Oh, I'm not sure about this next one. <laughs> uh, this is definitely not <laughs> something I would ever pick up for myself, though we'll try it on. We'll see. Um, it is sleeved. I had to pull that one out. So that's a plus size and it does have that twist front top that I have been wanting. So I'm interested to try that out. We'll see though, this patterning is usually not something I ever go for. But that is the Collective Concepts Nalene Pleat Detailed Tie Front Top. And it is $58. Again, totally reasonable for me if it's like a nice top. Okay, and I think this is the denim skirt here. So we'll see how this one looks. Hopefully it works a little bit better and <laughs> I can actually get it over my butt. But this one is the Just Black Stormy Released Hem Denim Skirt and it is $58. And I've been wanting a denim skirt, so fingers crossed that it actually works. Ooh, and these are fun. So these are the shorts she sent. I don't know how I feel about the button fly. I had somebody tell me once that all I needed to do was size up and it wouldn't have been an issue where it kind of looked like the buttons were all popping. So we'll see how that works with shorts because I already have to size up for shorts. And then I also have to size up even more because of a button fly. I don't know. Um, but I'm, I'm willing to try them again. I think I wrote that I wasn't interested in them, so I'm a little surprised she did send them. But I like the amount of distressing. Again, this is so, I don't even know. Like, in the past, I hated distressing. Absolutely hated it. I thought it was horrible. And then I got these really nice pair of distressed jeans, and now I love this style. So who knows? Maybe I just got to get the right type of button fly, and then I'll fall in love with them. But those are the Just USA Jossy Frey Hem High Rise Shorts. And they are $48. So far the price is pretty nice though. I did just see the price of this jacket right here. And also it's summer. I'm not gonna wear this jacket in the summer. Minnesota gets really cold you guys, but our summers get really hot, like really, really hot. Um, we kind of just get both extremes and it's humid. Oh, it's horrible. But this is the jacket and this is just, it's very heavy though. This is a style I do enjoy. I just don't know if I'll end up keeping it because this is the Liverpool Nima Moda denim jacket and it is $109. So um, I have to really, really like it in order to keep it uh, because that's a lot. And who knows if I buy all five, maybe it'll be worth it. You got the discount, but we'll see. I don't know. I mean, red, I don't think the fact that it's red is going to bother me. I do like red and there are some chillier days in Minnesota, even during the summer, like after it rains, it gets kind of cold. Um, but like, I don't know, we'll see, $109, that's a lot. All right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and try these on and show off all these outfits for you and kind of just give you my thoughts as I'm trying them on. Okay guys, here is the first outfit. This is what it looks like. I'm not gonna keep this blouse. It's just not a print type that I, I ever wear. Also, um, it's tight in the arms and it actually fits perfectly right here, um, but it's also just very baggy and this is a style I just don't want to have more of in my closet. I'm trying to get away from baggy clothes. Um, and so I can't really size down though because then it would be too tight in the chest and it would definitely be too tight in the arms. So I'm not gonna get this shirt, um, but these shorts are actually really nice. I'm gonna show them off a little bit here. Uh, the bun fly, I think this size it actually works out pretty well. They're, these have a lot more stretch to them, which I think is really, really nice as well. The only thing maybe I'm not liking the most is there's distressing right over the pocket. And so like sometimes when you go in, you might accidentally hit the distressing. Very, very picky. But I think otherwise I like these. They're extremely comfortable. They fit really nicely. Um, I don't feel like they're squeezing me at all, which usually is what happens with shorts for some reason. Um, so I think I'm probably gonna end up keeping these shorts because I need more of them. I don't have many shorts. <laughs> so I think this will be a really, really nice addition to my closet. But now I'm gonna go ahead and try on the other three pieces. Okay, here is this outfit. I don't know how I'm feeling about the jacket. Um, it's not big enough that I could actually zip it up, but it's also, it's it, like, I don't think the brightness factor bothers me too much, but the price, I just don't know if it's worth the price for me, especially during the summer. Like this is just too heavy for the summer. Like I would never throw this on. I would throw a cardigan on first. Um, so I think this is just, this is just too much. Um, I also, for some reason, when I put it on, it felt like I was going to work. <laughs> I 
and uh, I don't have a type of job like that. I don't need work clothes necessarily, so I'm kind of leaning towards a no with the jacket, um, but I'll probably play with it a little bit more just to like see if I'm still feeling that, but that's where I'm heading right now for this guy. Here's the things that were under it just to show these off as well. Here's the little back detailing. I'm also not going to keep this skirt. Um, I finally got to try on the style, which I'm very excited for, and I'm just going to, I'm going to say no <laughs> where I'm at right now. It just hugs everything in the wrong way, and I'm even wearing Spanx, but like it just hugs all of it in a way that just does not make me feel good when I look at myself. So um, this is definitely a style that I'm not going to keep. I also didn't like that it flared out here like if I'm gonna get a type of skirt like this I wish it would have been fitted throughout the whole entire thing rather than just flaring out at this point point. and I really wish she had not sized up on this like this is extremely stretchy and so it's just very big um so I might see about sizing down for this one but I'm not exactly sure either I might just stick with the shorts <laughs> and call it good we'll see though um I also have to see if they have this size in stock because I think the last few times I've tried to exchange things they've been out of that size so I guess we'll see with that I'm not exactly sure um, but that's kind of my thoughts on these guys as well I am excited that I can finally say jean skirt probably not my thing right now maybe sometime in the future we'll see um, but where I'm at right now this just isn't isn't gonna work for me <laughs> So those are all my thoughts. Um, I definitely am going to keep the shorts. I really like them. They are very, very comfortable. I feel good in them. Um, I already have a lot of stuff that I can pair with them. So I think those will work great. Um, definitely not going to keep the blue guy. This is just not my style and it's way, way too big. This is actually the opposite issue I thought I was going to have. Things fitting and then things being too big. I did not think that was going to be the problem today. But other than that, you guys, I hope you all are doing well. Um, and just know that I'm thinking of all of you and whatever challenges you might be facing in this moment. Um, cause this is a crazy time we're all in and I just want to be an ally for all of you. Um, and I really care about all of you and thank you so much for supporting my channel and supporting me as well. It really means a lot, but that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you guys really enjoyed seeing what I got this time. Let me know in the comments below what you thought about these, what styles do you really, really like? What styles do you not like that maybe showed up in here as well? But if you are new to my channel, I would absolutely love it if you would subscribe and click the little bell that is down below so you can get notified for all my future content. Also make sure to give this video a thumbs up. It really helps me out. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.